test something for the adrenaline junkies. Mzansi's high-profile spinners have gone head-to-head -to, -head to be crowned the 2020 Red Bull Shea Moto champion. And we're now joined in studio by the winner, Kakleho Mkhoshi, also known as King Katra. Good morning to you, King Katra. First of all, before we get into the Shea Moto competition, what is spinning? For those of us who aren't aware, what is spinning and what is involved? How did you get involved? Um, spinning is something that's between E30s and adrenaline junkies, people who, who are all about fun. Mm. So I went into the sport with my father that introduced everything in the family and made them believe in the sport and not look at it as a bad thing. Yeah. And it's actually something you do, something that I prefer, to, uh, that uh, the youth can join to stay away from drugs, from the streets and everything. But then it's quite a nice spot. It's quite interesting that you mentioned that, you know, your father made sure that you knew that it's not a bad thing. Because, you know, there's a bit of a stereotype that spinning yes. is, is linked to, you know, people often think that it's linked to, you know, gangs and, and dangerous, you know, acts and, you know, you know, cause it, basically. Yeah. So there are those stereotypes that needed to be, to be beaten. But I'm just bringing it back to the fact that it's heritage day today. It's also a bit of a cultural thing, is it? Yeah. I remember when we were younger, we used to go to this place called Spin City in Pretoria to go watch the spinning. It's quite cultural, isn't it? Yes, it is. Mm. All right, so talk to me about the Shai Moto competition. How did you get involved and how tough was the competition? Um, I was invited to join the event last year, mm. but I couldn't make it because I had car problems and financial problems. But this year was a bit different because I had a plan B. So I joined through Vigparal and everything went smooth and weird like practice sessions the whole week before Saturday. Yeah. So it started being more challenging on Saturday when the competition actually started. Mm. But then I had to readjust and stay calm, put my nerves down and be myself. All right, now for anybody who wants to get into spinning, what kind of advice would you, would you give? What kind of training do they require? Um, from my side, I prefer teaching anyone, mm. costless. I don't charge people to teach, teach them how, well, whatever they can do. If you're able to do it, come to me anytime. You just need a spin car. I can teach you anything for advice. It's not a bad thing. Yeah. If you're thinking of joining the sport, it's a good idea. Yeah. So, yeah, if ever you want advice, catch me on Instagram on King Katra, mm -hmm. Katra Mahoshi on Facebook. And for anything you need to know about spinning, touch me. All right, this is a very cool trophy. I have to say, I haven't seen a trophy that looks this cool in a very long time. It's an entire tire complete with the rims. What is next for you? I know that, you know, there's been a bit of a inactivity because of COVID-19, but now the Shine Motor competition is out of the way. You are the 2020 champion. What's next? Um, we we're thinking of hosting a Thanksgiving event for the community, but then we're going we're gonna to hear from our sponsors yeah. and people that are helping us around us, but then we'll take it from here. So when so if, if somebody wants to start spinning, do they need to have the car first of all? Do they need to have a license? Just let's just pretend that I'm someone who wants to start. What do I need to do? No, you don't need a driver's license okay. to join spinning. You just need a spinning car that someone can teach you with mm. and a place a secure place where you can do that because you don't need to be hurting people and mm. making it look bad. But then that's all you need. All right, King Katra, thank you very much for stopping by. All the best for whatever you've got coming up next. Thank you very much. All right.